Lily and fellow Make Peas Not Beef listeners. I'm Rob from San Francisco. First of all, love the title of the show. So funny. As soon as I read it, I knew I had to listen into more. And I appreciate you demystifying some of the harder to grasp concepts for climate change to help us get up to speed with what we need to do. I've been recently listening to How to Save a Planet on Gimlet Media and Dr. Ayanna Elizabeth Johnson's framework for how to find what brings you joy, how to use your special skills and superpowers, really focusing that in on what the climate action movement needs. That Venn diagram where all of those meet just makes a lot of sense to me. Uh, I would love to know how you think about that framework and how you uh, are using your skills as a force for good in the climate action movement. Uh, Rob from San Francisco, look forward to the show. Hi Rob, thank you so much for your message and I'm so happy that you like the show. And yes, I definitely know about Dr. Ayanna Elizabeth Johnson's work, however, I did not know about the framework, so I actually went to look it up now. So it's basically a Venn diagram that says the best way to tackle climate change is by figuring out the intersection of the following three things. Uh, what brings you joy? What are you good at? and what needs to be done. So based on this, here are my answers. So what brings me joy? That's anything that's creative. Uh, what am I good at? I would say podcasting, video editing, directing, and writing. What is the work that needs to be done? Uh, definitely climate education. So based on this, what should I be doing? I think I should be a climate creative, and that's precisely what I call myself these days. And yes, I did come up with that term. So Rob, hope that answers your question, and I'd love to know what your answer is. Thanks so much for listening to Make Peace Not Beef, and stay tuned for more exciting episodes down the road. Mm -hmm.